this time here in Oxford. Oh, wonderful. And right. I want to tell you all about what it is, because in some ways I, 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 it, it was chosen really for this purpose. Um, it's from the Ashmolean, so where we had dinner the other night. Oh, yeah. It's from the museum. And in the museum there's an Italian picture, which is very, 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 very famous as a picture, because it was the very first painting with perspective. Oh. So it's a very, if you, I know many of you haven't had a chance to get in <laughs> tourist and get into the Ashmore. It's a great picture, you have to oh. come again. You'll see that. And I'm really, I think it's so interesting, your poem this morning, um, because it's absolutely a poem that relates to this picture. Oh. So it's a picture of a hunt uh -huh. and arrows, and it's in a wood, and there is a whole system. So I pass it to you and then you can maybe pass it round. Mm. It's a very complex picture. Oh, wow. So you don't know where to put your eye, except there is a perspective which is going through the wood. And I think in a way, oh, as a metaphor for what you've just been talking about, this last piece of, yeah. in a way, where is TA? Mm. Where is organisational TA? Where are we going? There is something about going through the woods. Mm and something about being hunted and hunting, mm -hmm. and all of this. <laughs> <laughs> and woundedness, of course, and the arrows, and pointing the direction. Yeah. So it was a wonderful... <laughs> <laughs> wonderful. <laughs> and, 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 and my, my, my star sign, how do you see? Yeah, his star sign. Is, yeah. is Schütze. Uh, yeah. Sagittarius. Yeah. Sagittarius. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but it fits very well. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Rosemary. <laughs> So, and this is a jigsaw puzzle. This is the other oh, reason. Puzzle. It's a jigsaw puzzle. <laughs> so the puzzle is putting together uh -huh. the perspective. <laughs> so it's, yeah, absolutely. Wonderful. So whether or not you like jigsaw puzzles is irrelevant. <laughs> I, I like the, at least I like the metaphor. <laughs> and I think the word we were trying to find with the triangle is something about, uh, that came into my mind, was putting together the jigsaw puzzle. Yeah, wonderful. And helping people in organisations put together. Yeah, the jigsaw puzzle being oh. on many levels. Maybe everyone at the same level. Yeah, sure. <laughs> so before, thank you first. You're very welcome. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, well. I, I, I love to be here, and we talked uh, yesterday evening a lot. Be before we close this session, if if you want just to comment on the three days. Uh, on this level of reality, before we then change roles and settings, you're welcome to do so. It's not necessary to give me more applause. It's just what I like is char uh, characterizing what you have been meeting. This is from India to Perth. Oh. It's, oh. <laughs> it's a wall hanging. Oh, wonderful. The metaphors and images. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> This is one more for our uh, first ah, for Andre. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> this is a, this is a wish for the future. <laughs> <laughs> this is the context for the content. <laughs> to watch some, someone so skilled in dialogue in this kind of dialect. Yes. Um, it's a real pleasure to have, I feel I've learned a lot as an mm -hmm. adult educator yeah. in this, uh, oh. very much so. Mm -hmm. Yes. Yeah, so Wonderful. Thank you. For me, that <laughs> mm -hmm. I also really appreciate the way that you conduct mm -hmm. the brings that you can the pieces, the two pieces, are very rich, and uh, I'm very glad with the company and with this group. Thank you very much, mm. and also for Rosemary for right. the organization and invitation. Yes, she's a mother of all that. <laughs> <laughs> I'm very grateful for the the full experience. Mm -hmm. Really, yeah. uh, I. I I would have problems in uh, separating it into pieces because I because the feeling I have is uh, that it's a full experience with yeah. you, with Rosemary, with the group, with the different moments that we have been sharing together mm. and mm. the different exposures. Mm. And I think there is a lot to, at least for me, there's a lot to think about. Mm -hmm. um, uh, and uh, I 
and uh, and I, I think this is the beginning of a sort of new new road in a way. Wonderful. That's the way I feel it. Mm. Do you think part of it is because we're all from all around the world? I think this helps this feeling of background, <laughs> complex background. I think it, it's it's part of it. I think also there's some kind of very in the good sense of the word, some kind of very anarchistic mm. sort of feeling. You wearing suits. Which suits a bit the, this assembly in a way. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And anarchists have always opened the way for new things. Yeah. All over. <laughs> in history, I saw that note. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, me also, it was, um, it was a wonderful experience. Because it uh, it is two way uh, growth for me. One is the first travel out of my country. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, oh, yeah. and, uh, it's a lot. There's a lot of Rosemary's effort in giving a lot of papers from UK to <laughs> so that my visa is available. <laughs> so so I thank Rosemary for that. Oh, wonderful! And another is to step into another culture uh, of systemic culture, mm -hmm. which has broadened my ability to look things differently. Because uh, in the journey of CTA, I was also integrating many other schools like the uh, Ericksonian <coughs> Virginia Satire model. But I was always scared to talk that in a TA forum. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But after seeing you, using a piece of whichever suits mm -hmm. for the client, <coughs> which is appropriate, <coughs> gives me a model of integrating wow, various things because I have always seen Erickson, uh, Ericksonian method he has used the rebellious child to help the uh, adult ethic so that's that's a feeling I used yeah, to have yeah. but there's a lot of TA connection we can see in many different ways mm -hmm. but I've been discounting that part to connect and see or I was scared to do that mm -hmm. so you've been a role model there and stepping into organizational field to have a systemic view not only in organizational field, I think in psychotherapy also the system plays a role. Today morning I was having a supervision with Rosemary. I remembered a poem of uh, Galil Gibran. Mm -hmm. Or Gibran, how you yeah. pronounce it. Yeah, yeah, Galil Gibran. So he talks about uh, in the poem of failure, I think so it's failure the topic, where when a leaf turns yellow, instead of just looking at the leaf, you also need to look at the tree yes. for the cause for that mm -hmm. to become turning yellow. Mm -hmm. So that's somewhere a systemic view he has had as a poet. Yeah, wonderful. So yeah. that was going on in my mind. So <laughs> we may just look at the individual, but there's a tree behind. Maybe there's an ecosystem behind. Right. Which influences the individual over there. Wonderful. So that has broadened my frame of reference from here. Mm. Thanks, Bunch, and then thanks, Rosemary, and thank all of you. Mm. Mm. Uh, when I read first time, many months ago, uh, you article, uh, I spoke with you yesterday. My wish uh, look and your wish has, yes, has been has been a presentation, your presentation and. Uh, my wish satisfied. Wonderful. My my meet with this group very Couple. lovely. <coughs> thank you. Mm -hmm. Thank you. And thank you. Uh, okay. And thank you. Very special was Mary. You have stepped to meet me. Mm. Thank you. Thank you, Rosemary, for facilitating this. this and again, it's um, you know, I feel quite moved about the, the generosity that you bring in every way. You know, like I look around, this, you just bring so many. You've got so many things. Like it's like being in an absolute uh, wonderful. Yeah, this, yeah, it is. It's well lovely. This box is it full of toys. And in that too, there's you know, thank you, Moon. That's you know what you've shared. It's um, it is a real gift. And isn't it? I just find it interesting around time and 
these things, these concepts in your thinking, that it's over two decades old, mm. and uh, and how you sit with that, um, you know, I find you know quite moving too. Mm. And, um, you know, the other thing, because um, I've been writing quite a bit lately, and just I'm feeling more and more connected to a relational model. Um, and to see, I see that in you. I see that's a real essence of you of being relational and, mm. and bringing all, all of our parts of ourselves within the organisational context. I, you know, you're living proof that that's absolutely possible, mm-hmm. you know, that we can you know, do that. Um, yeah, I really like that. It's been a real, mm. been a, real um, a good experience. I've been lovely connecting with everyone. Like, I think every, um, each of my TA. Um, journeys have always left a good imprint and I think um, the other thing is around that we do learn from our other cousins you know from our psychotherapy and our counselling and our Mm. educational cousins that um, you know there's a lot of things that we have in common and yet we've got some really good things that are different I kind of like to hold on to that because I think I might have a Pollyanna view on the world. I, I know there's little wars go on and there's tensions and things like that, but I think there's a lot of things that actually keep us, bind us together, you know. Mm. Um, yeah. So that I've, <coughs> that sort of stirred all that up in me. Really. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. And it's been really lovely. Thank you. Mm. I can continue and... Uh, I try to not get emotional now. Mm-hmm. Uh, I have written down. <laughs> <laughs> I think that uh, we together with you and, uh, and with Rosemary's help uh, <coughs> both integrate and clarify topics uh, that is very sens- essential for the development of meeting with people in a good way. Uh, my needs has been fulfilled and I have felt respected and welcomed and in some point as I, I was home. And I think we all have embraced complexity. Mm. So thank you. Mm. Mm. You're welcome. It's certainly been um, a very rich three days mm-hmm. for me. Mm-hmm. I did um, I did bring all of your English articles. <laughs> it's a long plane trip from Australia. <laughs> so I thought I'd like to be in touch with, you know, what you've written over yeah. the years. Yeah. Um, but it's... Uh, we can read, but there's nothing like the real thing. Mm. Yeah. It's, uh, uh, listening to how you explain things has been fantastic. But then when we've either questioned or challenged or asked for more clarification, um, a big learning for me is in the approach you take Mm -hmm. to responding Mm -hmm. uh, uh, to that. And uh, and very much, uh, as others have said, that the inclusion of other things you've learned in life is just the tapestry of who you are. Um, And I think that's just a wonderful permission to not be so narrow in our mm. own effect as um, whether we're organisational or not, or whether we're TA or not. It's just as being fantastic human beings. Mm-hmm. And uh, for me, you've you've displayed, you've demonstrated that mm. so much more than I can get from the reading. Mm. You know, so, uh, so this format... Um, whilst it's quite hard <coughs> for me and the audience to sit uh, for such a long time, yeah. um, uh, nevertheless is still very rich and, uh, you know, the times when I did have a little snooze, mm-hmm. I know that, you know, I will have... Osmosis to me is, uh, <laughs> is amazing. Un- your unconscious mind. My unconscious will mind. get it. <laughs> yes. Yeah, thank yeah. You. So uh, thank you, Rosemary, for... <coughs> the part you played in bringing us all together as well. It's fantastic. Thank you. And to Andre for... Not now. Yes. Later on, we will have a DVD. Wearing his um, 
Simpsons, Simpsons t-shirt today. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Are we through? Oh. I'd like to just have to focus on one side. I have been difficult to sit in one position for so long. So for me it was a physical struggle, but I think on many layers it's uh, like a metaphor for my struggle in sitting with my psychotherapist chair and I really want to expand more and this wonderful opportunity on mm-hmm. this level. But also on the theory, TA level, the TA level theory, it was an expansion which was beyond my expectation. Mm-hmm. And uh, I think it sort of shifted me to a different dimension. I mm-hmm. don't know what I'm doing there yet, but I mm-hmm. did. <laughs> 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 so and I'm really happy to do this journey with all of you. Oh, so wonderful. You. Yeah. And you, Finisha? Um, uh, before I came, I tried to read all your articles, and I was lost. Um, I mean, I understood bits of it, but I found, I remember finding it difficult and being worried about it. Mm. Should I uh, know all of it before I go? Mm. And then, um, and I have to admit, this, these three days have, there were pockets when I was still grappling with work. Mm. And there were points where I felt like everyone has so much more experience within an organization. And I've got pockets of doing organizational work. And I felt at points inadequate and said, oh, you know, I've come all this way and am I learning enough? Am I getting enough? And so that was the dilemma I was sitting with that am I, um, is it enough? And, uh, but I think, I don't know, it's, we had a very short conversation for a few minutes yesterday yeah. about meaning making and about how I struggle with making some meaning for myself. Mm-hmm. And I connected with the idea of the person with the string cut mm-hmm. and not have it. And then it was almost like a permission to make, in our direct conversation, to make those meanings. Mm-hmm. And I have a little picture that I'm drawn for myself, it just makes a lot of sense for me. And what is on it? Um, it's kind of like, it's meanings that I have borrowed from others and own them, which no longer work for me. Mm-hmm. And it kind of fits very well with your the architecture for the you know, the building that needs to be, mm-hmm. the new elements, the good elements need to be kept and need to be reconstructed and stuff like this. Yeah. Mushrooming of structures mm. Mm. so it's a it's a clarity in terms of seeing meanings i've taken which are, are not helpful and where i am right now which is a zone of confusion sometimes and a lot of back and forth movement and trying to get clarity and sit with the struggle and sit with the dilemma and work through it slowly and have the permission to not know all the time mm-hmm. and still be part of it mm. And then some pieces of meaning that I, I'm making for myself. So it's almost like uh, instead of letting all these buildings mushroom, I'm willing to take the time to break down what's there, mm-hmm. hold what's good, and mm-hmm. rebuild. Mm-hmm. So, you know, and when, and, uh, when Rosemary said, we, you need an architect, and I said, well, I'm the architect. Mm-hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you know? So it was just amazing. And, you know, I'm just so glad that mm-hmm. I had this opportunity. Mm-hmm. So I feel so enriched so uh, that I could share this, and I feel relieved that we have now it's all on DVD and whenever, <laughs> whenever somebody wants me to lecture on it, and I'm not into it, <laughs> take the DVD <laughs> or ask people who have been with me what they made out of it. They will grow their own garden with it. Thank you, and thank you, Rosemary. And now we are, we have permission to go for lunch break. For how long? Shall we aim to be back here for two? Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah. yeah.